y'all. It's your girl Anitra here with Different by Design, where faith and fashion connects. I'm coming to you today with another video. If you are returning to my channel to watch another one of my videos, hey girl, hey. If this is your first time stopping by my channel, welcome. Just make yourself at home. Just click the like button, click the subscribe button, click the notification bell so you can stay tuned for all things faith and fashion. Hoo child, y'all. It is Monday. When I tell you I was excited to create this spring transitional looks lookbook until I went out today, y'all. My goodness. I'll show y'all this outfit. This is our, our outfit of the day, but it's also a part of this uh, lookbook video. Baby, when I tell you this trench coat, these sweatpants, when I tell you I felt like I was laid up on the beach in Miami somewhere, well, all of this, all these clothes on. I didn't check the weather. That's my bad. I didn't check the weather. But people are out and about today in t-shirts and sweatpants. And here I t-shirts and shorts. And here I come dressed like I don't want to let it go. <laughs> like I'm holding on to a season. Now I do have on um, this bodysuit. It's sleeveless, but it didn't matter. It didn't matter. Today's lookbook, I am tapping into my neutral side. I feel like I gave y'all the whole box of crayons the last two videos. We are testing out our neutral girl bag. We are in our neutral girl bag. Um, I think there might be one or two pops of color, um, but for the most part, everything else is neutral. Okay, very much neutral. Um, yes, we have a little bit of everything. And because I just gave y'all almost a two hour long video, <laughs> and before that, um, over an hour vlog, we just gonna hop right into this video, y'all. Just hop right in. So if you are ready to see, I think it's, child, I'm not even gonna give you all a number because every time I give you all a number, it ends up being way more. If you are ready to see my spring lookbooks video, I am 5'7", I am plus size-ish, I'm very much in apple shape. Um, stay tuned. Okay, so this was the outfit of the day. Child, when I sit still, I'm fine. But when I get up, I'll be sweating again. <laughs> Y'all, I, I had to give myself like an hour or two to dry off because all right here, all right here was just wet. With sweat, like what's happening? What? Whew. Trench coat is from Target. Pants are from Target. Bodysuit is from Shein. And then we are carrying her today. Coach. And then the shoe of the day. Child, listen, I'm too old to be trying stuff. The shoe of the day was our Birkenstocks. Very comfy, chic. Very, um, very elevated casual. Very elevated throw and go. Let me show you guys the look without the trench. So as you can see, I had on several layered necklaces. Um, no matter how, what size necklace I wear, I still end up looking like Mr. T. They're all chunk, all like tangled up and stuff about the neckline. But this is the bodysuit from Shein. Are these pants too big? Yes. Okay, I'm still kicking myself for getting an extra large instead of a large, but I didn't want to um, be wasteful and buy them in a large and try to sell or give away. Like I was just like, girl, we're just gonna work with what we got. Learn your lesson. I'll learn a lesson eventually that I need a large and not an extra large. But y'all, when I tell you, like this is very elevated casual. Again, neutral girl. Um, this is the bag. And these were the glasses of the day my dime optic sunnies i have to get better at including accessories in my videos outside of just the bag but this was the look of the day again like i said very elevated casual don't ask why i have on a leopard print bra i didn't realize that it was going to be an issue until i put on i was pretty much dressed for the day but y'all don't y'all listen this is the look <laughs> Okay, it's always something. This is the look of the day. I was going to add the um, matching guitar strap, but I didn't feel like digging for it, so I just carried her as a top handle. Everything turned heads, but I was hot. 
of the whole time. And this trench coat, like no matter if you put it in the dryer or if you steam it, it's going to be wrinkled. And that's something that irks me about this trench coat. No matter what you do to it, it's going to be wrinkled. But yes, y'all, this is look number one. I have to get better at tying the trench in the back so it gets more of a, oh, that's so much better. Listen, I have to get better at that because as you can see, it automatically added some shape. It's not just like I'm wearing this denim, denim bag, this denim sack. Um, oh, that looks so much better. But now that it's time to put it away, <laughs> You live and you learn, okay? All right, so show what is it Final look of the day, outfit of the day. Hopefully you guys can see the shoes. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Okay, so we just did a denim, a denim trench look. I'm gonna give you guys a regular trench look. This is the, the basic. This is the bare necessities of the look. We have our wide leg, distressed denim jeans. It's time for new ones, sis. But I just love these jeans so much. We have one a basic, regular, regular black bodysuit from Shein. You guys have seen both of these pieces several times on my channel. What if we pair this plain look and we elevate it? Take this plain look and we elevate it. Now listen, y'all. Okay. I didn't realize that this coat was not hung up. It was folded up in a bin. So is she a little wrinkled? Yes, because I found it last minute. Okay, look past the wrinkles. Y'all know, it, unless you are new here, <laughs> unless this is your first video with me, okay? Unless this is your very first time stopping by this channel. You down for these shenanigans, okay? Now, Am I still on the hunt for a longer trench? Absolutely. Have I been successful in finding a cute one because that is to my standard because I'm very picky when it comes to trench coats. I don't want any ruffles. I don't want any, um, no extra frills. Just basic, where in the world is Carmen San Diego? That's what I want. Okay, so I have it tied a little too tight in the back. Yes, but let's just pretend that I, I steamed this before the video. Let, let's just make believe. So, how would I continue to style this look? We can go two ways. We can either go, let me see, how am I feeling with this look? We can either go white sneaker or black shoe. Now, here's the thing. Let me grab them. Um, so black shoes, I want to go, oh yeah. For a black shoe, I kind of want to go here because again, it's springtime and low key, it's time to put the boots away. So I kind of want to go here with it. And if I do black shoe, um, I'll go with the Georgie Gym. Okay, we can go here. However, if I go, white sneaker if I go white sneaker okay just basic front of the mill white sneaker running errands I will go with the red tabby can y'all catch the vision can y'all catch the vision okay now I feel like the vision would be even better with a longer trench but again the purpose of these videos is to not shop to work with what you have and style that I can even throw in, let's see, for accessorization, where is it? You can never find things where you need it. And it better not resurface at the end when I'm done and over making this video. Please hold. <laughs> All right, so I found the accessory I was looking for and that's this Adidas hat. But I also have my sunnies here. And when you think trench coat, you think rainy day, but no, we're not thinking that right now. And so, listen, I put the heels on, y'all. Hopefully, y'all can see them. I put the heels on, but I, that makes me disappear. But I have on the sunnies. And then our bag, the Georgie Gym. This is cute. 
This is cute. Yes, this is a moment if the coat was steamed. <laughs> this would be cute. This jacket, trench coat has like a polka dot lining. This is an old navy piece several years ago, y'all. Several years ago. Um, my jeans are from Macy's. Shoes are she in. Uh, this um, black bodysuit is she in. Coach. And then my key, Sunnies. All right, so this is a look. Uh, let me show you guys what it looks like with the white sneakers. Okay, so I decided to change bodysuits for this look. So we have on a, it's like a off-white colored bodysuit. Um, again, she in. Um, still have on the necklaces. Still have on the same jeans. We just added our white sneakers. We are going to put on the trench yet again. I just, I wasn't feeling the white um, sneakers in the red bag with the black bodysuit. I told y'all I'm picky, okay? It has to blow. Now, let me retie this in the back. Y'all, so the last try on video, the last um, transitional looks video, I was so bloated, y'all, it wasn't even funny. When I tell y'all the very next day after I made that video, guess who came knocking on my door? I feel it's so disrespectful, y'all. But I'm happy that's why. And it's not like, girl, ooh, you can't fit none of your clothes. <laughs> you need to stop eating. All right. <laughs> so now that she's going, things fit a little better. So this is the look with the white sneakers and the red tabby. Now we need some glasses. We're gonna throw on a different pair of keys because they have gold um, hardware. It was a different pair of gold keys, different pair of keys um, because I'm wearing gold accessories and then the tabby has gold hardware. So this is a cute little run errands real quick, come right back. If it's hot, you got a little air conditioning right here. Again, pretend this coat <laughs> is steamed. If you are still looking at the wrinkles, <laughs> girl, stay focused, stay focused. <laughs> But yes, y'all, this is cute. This is cute. The other way I would wear this is um, if it was more of a, you know, closer to winter, um, because this jacket is, because this coat is lined, I would wear it with a, um, like an Oxford shirt or all like a oversized white shirt, tuck in one side, had the other side hanging out um or like a blue and white striped shirt and then the tabby will be like a little red pop of color the little pop of color but yes this is um this is very cute like early morning spring and then if you are comfortable um in the afternoon take the jacket off and then you're sleepless yes Talk amongst yourselves in the comments below and let me know what you think. Next slide, please. Okay, I decided to give it to you guys. So this is the Oxford I was talking about, like the blue and white stripes. Now this one, y'all, I have not worn it in a while. And this is why it's important to shop your closet because this is like a corset style top. Um, let me see here. It's very much corset style. And it's like, girl, is it time to give this away? It might be. I haven't worn this in about a year or so, but y'all get the vision. I would, if I buy another one, I wouldn't buy it like this style. But this, this uh, top is, I think it's rainbow. We're looking at circa, 2017, 2018-ish, yeah. And yeah, so this type of shirt, I would go very much more oversized because, because this is so detailed. Like I can't, um, it has so much razzle-dazzle in the front, like I can't go for the look. Maybe I could, 
took one side, headed the other side out, and then we still have one of our white sneakers and our red tabby. But this, that's what I would go for if this shirt didn't have so much detail in the front. But I just love this combo, the blue and white with the red and the trench. And low key, I wouldn't go distressed denim. I would go just regular wide leg jeans. Um, I don't know why skinny jeans crossed my mind, but I wanna, I'm done with skinny jeans, y'all. Like, I like the feel of flowy now. I'm out of my tight for no reason, but I do recognize also that on an apple shape and um, yeah, like, and if you're curvy, sometimes skinny jeans look a little bit more put together. But again, I'm just over being restricted and tight, okay? This is cute. This works. And again, if you are still looking at the wrinkles, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, sis. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. And then we put our glasses on. Yes, this will be cute if the shirt fit a little neater. I still have the bodysuit one underneath it, but yes. So technically you got three looks with a pair of jeans and a trench coat. Listen, talk amongst yourselves in the comments as I gather up the next look. Next slide, please. Okay, so the sun is going down a little bit or it's trying to, let me try to direct y'all a little bit away from So I don't know if that helped, but the sun is going down a little bit. <sighs> Trying to break up the denim looks. So this is actually a, a sweatshirt dress. As you can see, it has the lacy detail. This was featured in a sheet in haul a couple months ago. Um, I was gonna try to style it as just a dress, but I'm low key sick of, I was gonna try to pair it with like my white boots but I feel like at this point, like I know people are trying to figure out how to wear cowboy boots all year round. Um, so I have a pair with my wide leg jeans still, and I still have on my white sneakers. I have switched out to silver accessorization. Now I'm trying to like edge it up a little bit. Like I have like the lace detail and I have one like this chunky um chunky uh infinity now low key y'all this came from uh le walmart a couple years ago this is le amazon and then i want to pair it with these glasses also she and finds the gucci boots let's see how these look together Okay, and then the bag would be our Marc Jacobs quilted with the chunky silver chain. And I would do this. I would want more bangles, but I don't have any. Um, and I'm looking at this black and I'm like, how could we, what could we do? So that like, can we tuck her? because this dress by itself can read very much praise dancer. So how can we edge this dress up? Because I wanted it to have like the, the lace detail. Um, I wanted that, but I also wanna like, let's see how can we do this? Get the black together. I don't know, y'all tell me. I don't wanna look crazy, y'all. And a belt is not an option. <laughs> Listen, we, we, us plus size girlies, especially our, us apple shaped girlies, we, we were traumatized by the wide belt era, okay? All of us walking around looking like we were about to audition for the WWE to WWF belt this big, intercontinental, we off that, but, you tell me, how would you style this dress? I 
feel like we're over the put a jacket over it because chow is hot okay it's hot maybe if i put take off the sneakers and put on some heels let's try that please hold okay i have disappeared yet again so this is the look with the heels hopefully you guys can see now when i look at the camera i can see so hopefully you guys can see these shoes it made me taller, but how do we feel about this dress? I don't know, like I need more accessorization. That's what I need. I need more accessories. I need some bangles. Um, yeah, I need some, I need some bangles. I need to like, maybe even a chunkier necklace, like go crazy. What? My, my manners, where are my earrings? Um, I wouldn't do, I wouldn't do hoops with this look. Shall I? Uh -uh. Wait a minute now, please hold. Okay, so I have tight, taken off the Amazon necklace. I have tightened this choker. I've added some studs, but I'm missing is some ear cuffs, but I don't want to do too much silver because the glasses are black. Um, I think this is better this is better I still want some more accessories on my arm but finding arm candy that'll fit my arm has been very much a dilemma but y'all tell me y'all want to see what it looks like without the jeans let me give you the original outfit please hold okay so here is the dress with just the black shoe If I wear just the dress, I have to put biker shorts underneath it because this lace is, is very much lacing. Um, I have tightened the choker even more. I have changed to go to silver glasses. So this is an option, but let me just give you guys the white boots. So we can, I can cross it off my list <laughs> and say that I actually did it. But yes, the, just the black shoes kind of plays up the femininity of the dress, the lace. But let's see what the boots do, y'all. Let me get it off. Please hold it. All right. So hopefully you can see the boots. This is it, y'all. And I have to come to grips with the fact that these boots are not white. They are bone. Okay. And the fact that I did not get these boots in black, I'm still kicking myself. Uh, well, actually, you know what? No, because my size was sold out when they went on super sale. But I'm not feeling the boots with this dress. Y'all tell me what you think. I'm not feeling this look. It's... It's, it's just okay. I feel like it probably would have been better with the black boot. And I do have some, um, if I wanted to go edgy with what I already have, I do have some snake print um, knee boots, but they're away. I've already started putting away my winter stuff. They're away. I did not pull them for this video. So if I want to, um, more than likely what I can do is revisit this look um, in a fall lookbook with those boots, or maybe by then I'll have the black version of these. We shall see. All right, so we have technically, child, moving right along. <laughs> so, all right, so the graphic tee has entered the chat. We have on this lovely faded black graphic tee with Ken and Barbie, just a casual night out, dressed not just to the nines, but to the tens. Um, we still have on our silver glasses, but we may change that. We still have on our chunky choker infinity necklace and same accessories we might change these and then we have one of these camo pants they are like black and gray and um yeah like black and various shades of gray from Shein. and then hopefully you probably i can't even see them i have one of these silver pumps um here we are going to tuck as always and this 
you see it back here. This is an option. I'm looking in the mirror, y'all. This is a moment. I wish the necklace was chunkier. Um, what I may do, let me play around with some accessories. Um, but let me show you guys what I just discovered in my closet. Again, the importance of shopping your closet. Y'all, I completely forgot about this black denim jacket, y'all. Completely forgot. I was cleaning out my closet, um, trying to straighten it up so I could actually find stuff when I go in there, trying to color code everything, and found this black denim jacket. This is a rainbow piece. It is distressed denim. We're just gonna pop our collar a little bit. Um, yeah, distressed denim. The sleeves are already rolled up because when I discovered that I had it, I wore it. And so, does she have pockets? I don't even remember. Yeah, she has pockets. Listen, just a casual night out. Now we might stick with the same bag just to keep things edgy. We'll stick with the same bag. Um, we could go black shoes, but I wanna like switch it up a little bit. I wanna switch it up a little bit. Yeah, edge it up a little bit. Low key, what I wanna do, um, <laughs> now this is creative me. What I wanna do is, let me show you guys, please hold. Creativity has entered the chat, so. Girl, where you get that necklace from? Um, you mean this bag chain? You mean this bag chain that I've decided to style as a necklace? Pop the collar so the two uh, doll clips aren't showing. Listen, edgy. Yes, this works. What y'all think? What y'all think? Would y'all change the shoe and put on a black shoe? I feel like Barbie would do the most because look at look at how she's dressed. That's casual for her. She has on a whole ball gown. Her and, her and Ken are dressed to the nines. Why would I put on a black shoe and make this look regular? Now I could make this a crossbody and then just let this be the statement. Let's try that. But yes, y'all, creativity, creativity, creativity. It's a gift I'm thankful the Lord bless me to possess okay because sometimes <laughs> again you need to shop all of your accessories and get creative because at the last minute you don't always have an opportunity to run out and grab something you got to work with what you got and i believe i've done this before with a gold bag chain don't ask me what i styled it with y'all but i did it so here we have it as a crossbody but I still need Barbie and Ken to show. Yes, honey. Do the most, say less. The most will be done. <laughs> what y'all think? Talk amongst yourselves in the comments below. Next slide, please. Okay, so. So, denim shirt dress has entered the chat, okay? Yes, Target had one. This year, I was tempted to buy it until I remembered, girl, you bought not one but two denim shirt dresses from Shein last summer. Medium wash and light wash. This is the medium wash. It has a little pocket, a little razzle dazzle on the sides. It has pockets, pockets, pockets. All right, so we are going to pair this with sneakers. Um, I did not pull Adidas socks, but pizza socks for the win. This is the shoe of my Adidas. Okay. Bag wise, I think I want to go here with it. If the camera will allow, I think I'm going to go here. Our um, lamb gallery. And if I had different hair, I would go with this hat. So let me put everything together so you guys can get the full visualization. Please hold. Okay, y'all. So this will be the look. Um, this is the bag. What I would do is probably add a um, bag clip. So 
Or we'll wear it close body. Let's see. Yeah, either a bed, cliff, or crossbody style. Um, hopefully you guys can see the shoe. Very brightly colored. This is our second pop of color. Oh, I just thought about something, y'all. Ah, I thought I was getting ready to get to the cool down section of this video. I just The same outfit I forgot last video. I was getting ready to forget it again. All right, so, y'all, I'm tired and I'm hungry. Listen, my Apple Watch is on 10%. I'm like, y'all better still be counting my steps because trying on these clothes is my workout for the day. So we could go with our keys, but I wanna try these glasses I just got from Amazon. I'm trying to decide whether or not I wanna keep them or send them back. These here. You gotta know your own personal style. I can't, for me, I can't jump on every trend. I can't jump on every trend. If I wore these glasses with, um, because the glasses are brown and red, I, um, I wouldn't wear the hat. And low key, I'm not sure. Can y'all see the pizza socks? I don't think I would do pizza socks. I would probably do Adidas socks with maybe, um, yeah, because the socks are not coming up high enough for me. Mm. Yeah, you can't hop on every trend. I like these, maybe just not with this look. Let's try the keys, keys. Listen, the light just died. My watch is dying. What y'all think? With the keys, with the head. How about the head, right? Uh, what y'all think I'm ready for new hair I want my twist back so bad y'all but another topic for another day we off this I'm tired next slide please <laughs> this was the outfit I forgot pay no attention to the dress briefly this jacket and the matching pants okay this is all the color that you're going to get for this video I bought it last year from Fashion Nova. It said it was on, the sale price was everything. I bought this specifically to match this bag, okay? I had to justify getting this bag. So I was like, oh, this will be cute together. Couldn't find, been looking at this outfit all year until I wanted it last, last video. Couldn't find the pants. <sighs> And I was like, okay, there's a reason why I can't find these pants. And I felt like when I found them and put them on, I felt like that was God's way of saying, you, they don't fit. So <laughs> you were just fine. And so we are figuring out a way to style these pants as if they fit. Um, I don't know if I want to hold on to this look and, uh, you know, keep hope alive or if I just want to go ahead and stop playing and post this to my Poshmark. But we have it currently styled with a blue striped sweatshirt dress, sweat, blue and white shirt dress. Um, because this is uh, tie dye and then we have the stripes playing around with patterns and prints. And then we have the ombre tabby with all the colors. And I'm thinking because this could be passed off as elevated, um, I was going to go sneakers with this look, but I feel like a heel might work better. What y'all think? Now this bag has silver hardware. What y'all think? Okay, so we put on the silver shoe. I kind of like it. Now I was able to button the jeans. The Lord is good. Okay, but the zipper is like, no, because you're getting ready to take us right back off. And unless I wanted to sound like I um, uh, was huffing balloons, we're just gonna work with the butt. We're gonna be grateful for the button. But I think this is kind of cute. I would like the pants to be a little longer, but I think, yeah, the shirt dress saved the day. The shirt dress saved the day. Silver accessories, um, 
I would roll up the sleeve and hopefully you can see how crap this jacket is um, yeah because I'm an ankle shape I need something flowy if I'm going to go this to like balance out the cropped I could never wear a fitted top with this crop jacket I would look like Winnie the Pooh's girlfriend but I like yeah I like the the print mix I like playing around with, with prints and patterns and this this bag just pulls everything together is it matchy matchy absolutely absolutely I could go here to break up the color Oh, that's that's really cute let's put this down for a second I could go here to break up the color because this has silver hardware and then the jacket has silver hardware and then the silver shoe oh yeah that's really cute together okay so options options talk amongst yourselves I thought I had three looks left I'm going to stop at two because like I said sis is tired um, would y'all wear this together let me know in the comments below. Talk amongst yourselves. Next slide, please. Child, when I tell you I'm hot, I tell you no lies. The black shirt dress has entered the chat. And now we have on green camo pants, cargo camo pants. These are the green version of the pink ones I showed you guys in the last video. I got these first. Both pairs are actually from Fashion Nova. They're not from Shein. The ones I showed you guys earlier in the video, in this video, are Shein. These are Fashion Nova, similarly to the outfit I just showed you guys. These are a 1X. Um, they used to fit looser. Listen, it is what it is. Um, black shirt dress from Shein. You're going to pair it with, this is the only thing um, other than those sun, sunnies I showed you guys with the denim dress that are actually recent purchases. We found our gold shoes, guys. Nine West, we found our gold shoes. We're gonna pair this with some gold shoes um, and a denim jacket. And we're going to pull out our Gucci's. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Can you see the gold shoe? Move back as far as I can. So this is the, the gold shoes. I love these shoes so much, y'all. I'm so happy I found them. We have one. Now these aren't dupes. These are the real thing. Um, Nordstrom Rack Find. And so this is it as is. Okay, let's add the jacket. Now, this is the part I hate about jackets and long sleeves is that the struggle. Oh. Now I have a long line denim jacket, but I don't want to wear that with this. I want to let the dress do what the dress is supposed to do. And that is be a dress. And so good job. And I tell you, I am hungry and I am tired. And I just bought um, ingredients to make chicken salad, y'all. I still want it, but I don't want to be the one to make it. Listen, okay. I want somebody to make it for me. What y'all think with this bag? This is cute. We could also do um, the red tabby as a pop of color. Pull her back down. You can go red tabby as a pop of color. Or we could go matchy matchy and pull out the gold top and the Willis. If I go this route, I will probably add like a colorful twilly scarf. But this is cute. But I think. I'm feeling the tabby more. This is actually what I had in mind, but looking at it now, because it's very much matchy matchy. I like it. I, I like this size, but I like the pop of color. 
Um, we're gonna go here with it. Yes, honey. Talk amongst yourselves what you think in the comments below. We could go sneaker, we could go, um, oh, ciao. We could go sneaker. I wanted to go more feminine with the look. Um, I feel like the sneaker makes it a little bit more tomboy chic. So, we, but this is an option. If I went here, I would go here or with the Georgie Gem. Hoo cha. Give me some water, y'all. Give me some water. <laughs> Talk amongst yourselves in the comments. Last slide. Last slide. Let's go, y'all. <laughs> Last look, y'all, we have hit the smooth jazz section <laughs> of the video. This is very much, y'all know I love a good throw one and go moment. This is, I don't feel like getting dressed. I don't wanna go. It's the weekend, why do I have to put on clothes? Listen, it's a work day, why do I have to put on clothes? <sighs> throw one and go, it's giving Hershey kiss. Now, I could throw on a heel, but again, this is throw on and go. I don't feel like getting dressed. So we're gonna go here with it, with our Birkenstocks. Same ones we started off the video wearing. We're gonna close out wearing these. Now, the bag I want to reach for, for this look, um, it doesn't necessarily go, but we're gonna play. We're gonna play. Um, I'm going to pair everything with this long line denim jacket. I was going to style the black version of this show, but we've had enough black in this video. That would be the last look, but we've, we've had a couple black looks already. We can close out with brown. We started off with tan, we can close out with brown. Tan and a denim trench, we're going to close out with brown and a denim jacket. That's what we're going to do. So this is cute, very cash. Elevated cash, if you will. You see the shoe? And so the bag I want to reach for is this one. Now, y'all know I love, okay. So my camera cut off, I'm not fighting. I have it with the long line denim jacket. I have the key lime tabby. Y'all know I love chocolate brown and this lime together. I put on some silver hoops. I changed the watch band. Um, and I still have on the same shoe. I'm, I really don't like the shoe with this look. Um, let's see here. There's something else I wanna try, but before we get there, we have another pair of Amazon Sunnies that I'm trying to decide whether or not I wanna keep or send back. These are a dupe for, I think they were the Bottega dupes. I'm trying to see if they fit my personal style. So this is them right here. They are silver framed glasses. Uh-oh, <laughs> I think I like them now. The first time I tried them on, I was giving very much crunchy chic. I was cleaning the house and I didn't like them on me. Now I like them on me because I have on real clothes. We may be keeping them. <laughs> this is cute. What y'all think? Now, again, I'm not feeling these shoes. I do have these lighter Birkenstocks. I'm not really feeling these either with this look. So what we're gonna do is, I wanted to play around with styling scarves. Um, and this scarf has like a hint of brown in it. But low key, I think I might want to save this concept for the summertime. That's really what I bought it for, to wear it with a hat. But let's see how we feel. I don't want it to look like I'm getting ready to go to bed. Let oh, come on, scarf. I don't want to look like I'm getting ready to read somebody's palm either. 
but we have never styled, at least to my knowledge. We could go here. We've never styled this on my channel that I can remember. And I'm like, is this giving fall? Is this giving fall? I don't know. All I know is we're done with this video. Let me know what y'all think of this look in the comments. Would you go with the Dempsey tote? Or would you stick with the tabby minus, I mean, the pillow medicine minus the scarf? What y'all think about the glasses? Let your girl know, okay? That is it. If you have watched this point of the video, thank you so much. That concludes this spring lookbook. This is the final lookbook for the springtime. Enjoy the other two that will be posted in the description. Anything that is still available will also be posted in the description for your viewing pleasure. Thank you so much for stopping by. Time to make some chicken. And that concludes today's transitional looks video. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments below. Also make sure you click that like button, subscribe button, and notification bell so you can stay tuned for all things faith and fashion on my channel. If you know another girly who loves all things faith and fashion as well, don't be stingy, don't be a gatekeeper. Share this video with her so she too can stay tuned for all of the shenanigans <laughs> for all of the shenanigans on my channel again my name is anitra with different by design where faith and fashion connect and you have a great week